Happy New Year to you all! Welcome to 2017, the year of opportunity. I hope you had a great time away with your families and with your loved ones and got a chance to recharge your batteries. Myself, I was visiting friends and exploring around the Netherlands. I went to The Hague, I went to Delft, I went to Rotterdam, I went to Amsterdam and I just had a merry old time there. Spent New Year's there on Boxing Day. <coughs> I took some videos and posted them up earlier this year. I'd just like to thank the hospitality of all my friends in the Netherlands for putting up with me and showing me a good time, so thank you. Okay, down to business. So, for this year I wanted to redefine my channel and let you guys know why I'm on YouTube and why I'm doing what I'm doing. You could think of it as just a little bit of housekeeping just to keep everything in check. So the first thing on my list is to promote the lifestyle. That means cruelty free, healthy eating. That means having great adventures. And all in all, just good vibes. The second reason I'm doing YouTube is to document my journey. So I kind of just want to have an online diary, if it were, so I can look back on my experiences and see how I've grown over the years because my memory is awful right now and uh, I think when I get old I forget everything so something to look back on nostalgically and see what I was up to when I was this age 24 to 25. Third reason I'm on YouTube is to promote my brand so you've seen at the start of some of my videos the uh, World Wide Waves uh, symbol that comes up and I don't think I've really, really made that clear what that's all about. I want to use this brand when I start teaching surfing. It'll be in all my advertisements. I want to put it on some clothing, some hats, uh, surf equipment, surf rashes, maybe even wetsuits, who knows. And going forward, I what I really want to do, or what I think would be a good idea, is to have my own surf camp. So many good people there, you've got the partying side of it and then you've got the eating side of it, then you've got the adventure side of it and you've also got the surfing side of it. So you're keeping healthy, you're keeping fit, there's a social side and it just hits all the right dopamine receptors. <laughs> the other idea was to uh, start up a little convoy off my own van so that I could have a surf convoy as it were instead of a surf camp. So what would happen there is you book into the surf convoy and each small group gets a van and you guys follow the main convoy van, the convoy leader who's maybe in a big bus or whatever, takes the surfboards and you dot about the country going to all the great surf locations while camping out at night times and to me I think that's like, I think that's something that people would really like to do. So if you're travelling around in a van with a bunch of people you don't know and you're going around the country, seeing new places, meeting new people, you're socialising, you're learning a new skill, you're relaxing, you're just having a great time and I think it's pretty great and amazing and it will definitely catch on. I don't know, maybe you could comment below and let me know if you think it's a good idea or not. World as in destination or a mass of people made the area of influence of the brand waves wave riding surfing the waves of life also the w is split into two and shows two v's and you can only guess what that means <laughs> 100 subscribers thank you guys for subscribing and watching my videos you've been great the only reason i keep going is because people are watching my videos and i'm very very appreciative of all your support. Well, to celebrate, I'm giving five lucky people the chance to win a t-shirt. Now, I don't have the design yet, and I don't have them printed off, but they're in the pipework. So, all you have to do with the chance of winning a t-shirt is to like, comment on, and share this video, and I will randomly select five lucky people. I've also set up a Patreon site which allows you guys to kind of Help me fund my journey and get new equipment and break away from the 9 to 5 lifestyle. So I've linked that below if you want to have a look at it. No pressure, you don't have to give me anything, um, but it would be nice. Coming up this year I've got a few little excursions planned. Next month in February I'm going to Cairngorms on a snow sports trip 
um, with some guys and friends from school. In March I'll be moving back into the van so I'll show you a little bit more about van life and how I get by day to day. Also in March there's potential for me to go to the States for a, a wedding. In April I'm planning on doing a big cycle, North Coast 500. The full route's 500 miles and that should be an interesting trip. In May I've got a surf trip adventure planned uh, away to Portugal for a week and that should be fun. I'm also going to make the effort to twin up with some other YouTubers and get some collaborations. So that is my update for now and I would like you all to like this video, share and subscribe and as always, Vagabond Vegan.